aging according to ayurveda aging is natural but to age gracefully is an art in medical terms aging is a natural process of gradual decaying of all biological entities time reserves the right to control aging it interacts with the humans from conception till death that is during the entire life span this interaction with time governs various changes that occur in the body visa dosha dhatu mala agni and oja the old age is a condition where most diseases manifest the human body hence ayurveda recommends a holistic approach towards homeostasis and bodily humors balance so that the process of premature or untimely aging can be prevented how ayurvedic rasayanas help to deal with aging the rate of aging depends on the biological psychological social and lifestyle conditions of an individual these parameters either accelerate or prevent premature aging hence to prevent aging before time and to promote longevity a separate discipline of rasayana tantra has been documented by the ancient medical science of ayurveda the ayurvedic perspective of managing aging with rasayanas during the approximate 100 years of a human lifespan the following sequence has been considered by ayurveda the above sanskrit shloka explains the same in a tenor interval of the age of an individual childhood the first decade of life this is the most crucial time period for the growth of the brain as about 85% of the brain anatomically matures during this age secondly the first 10 years allow the body to interact with various biotic and abiotic elements to adapt and acclimatize with the environment essential herbs for a healthy childhood vacha and kashmari these herbs are considered nerve tonics for the brain due to their natural antioxidant property these herbs support healthy tissues of body during stressful or changing environments growth the second decade of life 11 to 20 years this time period is referred to as the period of physical growth the underlying reason is that by the end of this tenure the epiphyseal ends of the bones are closed essential herbs for a balanced growth ashwagandha and bala these herbs promote muscle strength and act as a natural source of organic energy during these teen years being adaptogenic these herbs promote calmness tranquility and positive energy in teenagers beauty the third decade of life 21 to 30 years this time period is referred to as the phase of glow aura as the strength vigor and vitality are at their peaks the last years of this phase of life secretly initiates the process of aging the reason is that the peak rates of metabolism start accumulating the wastes in the cells which deteriorate the efficiency to expel the toxins from the body essential herb for glowing and gorgeous beauty amalaki is widely used to promote beauty and longevity as it is rich in antioxidants and vitamin c amalaki naturally brightens the skin purifies blood and thus promotes a radiant skin medha intellect the fourth decade of life 
31 to 40 years. This phase begins to show the symptoms of the declined cognition. In the case of females, there is a noteworthy decline in their reproductive capabilities. Essential herbs for sound intellect. Sankha Pushpi and Jyotishmati. Sankha Pushpi is used as a rasayana for rejuvenation and Jyotishmati sports neurocardiovascular functions. Free radical squenching and antioxidant properties improve memory, intellect and immunity. Health of skin. The fifth decade of life, 41 to 50 years, this phase is particularly marked by the aged skin. There is also a potential decline in the health of teeth, heart and eyes. Nature gives you the face you have at 20. It's up to you to merit the face you have at 50. Youth is a gift of nature, but age is a work of art. Essential herbs for healthy skin. Bharangaraza, its anti-inflammatory properties prevent various skin problems like cirrhosis, acne, cracked heels, dermatitis and itchy scalp. Its natural antimicrobial properties prevent the inflammation of hair follicles and baldness. Vision The sixth decade of life, 51 to 60 years. This phase of life hinders the visual capabilities of the individuals. This time period also hinders the prostate, kidney and gut functioning due to aging. Essential Herbo Mineral for Sharp Vision Chasku and Sapt Amrita Loha Both are used as natural eye tonics to prevent the individual from various eye related problems. Chasku is used as collyrium in eye disorders along with Sapt Amrita Loha a dietary supplement for the source of iron. Sex The seventh decade of life, 61 to 70 years. This time span impacts the sexual health of the individuals due to a sharp decline in the male sex hormones. In fact, a loss of libido occurs in this decade. Essential herbs for healthy sex life Atma Gupta and Munjatka. These herbs possess natural aphrodisiac, food or drink that stimulates sexual desire and rejuvenating properties to balance the release of sex hormones and to maintain a healthy sperm count and libido. It is mentioned in the Ayurvedic scriptures that if the above seven stages of life are lived with the prescribed herbal regimen, the following three stages will not be requiring any additional herbal supplements and the common health issues of the old age such as degenerating intellect, poor skin health, vision, diminished strength and reduced physical activity can be naturally prevented. Strength The eighth decade of life, 71 to 80 years. This age period persists with spine deterioration symptoms. Additionally, a major chunk of muscle mass is lost during this time span. Wisdom The ninth decade of life, 81 to 90 years. This phase is well recognized with the degeneration of neurons. The reason is that during this period, the atrophy of the brain occurs, which lead to the deteriorated mental health and analytical processing. Physical activity. The 10th decade of life, 91 to 100 years. This phase is well known 
as the end phase most of the systems of the body start gradually becoming less functional in this stage even the fundamental requisites to carry out essential activities of daily living become impaired ayurvedic thumb rules to prevent premature aging follow the principles of swasthya varita such as tri upstam that is adequate diet sleep and quietus follow the principles of ayurvedic dincharya daily regimen and ritucharya seasonal regimen utilization of rasayana rejuvenating treatments and vajrakarna aphrodisiacs The goal of Ayurveda is to prevent premature aging and to promote longevity. Ayurveda can assist you to steer clear the degenerative effects of aging. So let nature optimize the development of your immunity and general health to rejuvenate your body, mind and soul with unique herbal rasayanas prescribed by the oldest medical science known to mankind enjoy happy and graceful aging